So you have a Samsung Galaxy A53 and you have an issue where you forgot your password or maybe your password is not working. It says incorrect pin entered. So what we can do here is we can factory reset it and then we can make a new pin, all right? The thing is with a factory reset, don't forget all your important um, personal settings, your videos, photos, all of that will be long gone, okay? So let's go ahead and factory reset this phone, okay? So let's say my password is not working or I basically forgot it, okay? So this is what we wanna do. And watch very closely, all right? So first thing we're gonna do is I mean, what we have to do is turn off the phone, but we can't turn off the phone because if we try to turn off the phone, it's going to ask us for a password that's not working or that we don't know. Okay, so this is what we have to do. First thing is we have to press and hold the volume down and power button. We're going to press and hold buttons together. As soon as the screen turns black, we're going to let go of both buttons, and then we're going to press and hold the volume up and the power button and keep holding until we see the Samsung Galaxy logo appear, then let go of both buttons, okay? So let's do this together, okay? Let me, let me put the screen on, so volume down, power, okay? Ready, set, go. Keep holding, wait till the screen turns black, just wait. Keep holding, both but volume down, power, wait. When it turns black, let go, and now press and hold the volume up and the power button. Keep holding, Samsung Galaxy logo, now I'm going to let go, and hopefully that boots us up into the Android recovery menu. If not, we'll have to try again. Okay, I did it my first time. Now, from here, what you can do is factory reset. You can scroll up and down using the volume rocker. So what you want to, go, what you want to do is go down to white data slash factory reset. Now, look down here. This is very, very important down here. It says, if your phone is reset, you may need, you probably will need, let me focus in. Uh, you may need to enter your Google account information, your email address, and, and password, okay, So your, to your Gmail account. So if you synced a Gmail account on this phone, once we perform the factory reset, when you start going through the setup, eventually it's going to ask you what Gmail address you had associated with this phone. So you have to um, type in that email address and the password content to, in order to uh, finish the setup, okay? So that's very important, okay? So anyway, I do have a, a Gmail address that's synced on here, and I do know my password and all that. So wipe data slash factory resets highlighted to select it. You want to press the power button. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and it's highlighted, wipe data slash factory reset, tap on the power button right there. And then you get this message up here. Basically, uh, once you do this, uh, this cannot be undone. So if you want to Proceed, move down the factory data reset, and then tap on the power button. It's formatting. Okay, look at that. Now it says wipe data complete on the very bottom here. Now it defaults us back up here. It highlights reboot system now, and that exa that's exactly what we want. So we're going to tap on the power button to reboot now. And now it's going to go ahead and perform a factory reset. This whole process will take about two to three minutes, so be patient here. And it's going to stay on the screen for a little bit, so be patient. And voila. Okay, so now we are in the setup, all right? Now, the thing is, once I go start going through the setup, eventually, when I go about halfway through the setup, or maybe three quarters away, eventually it's going to ask me um, my... If, if I had a Gmail address synced, it is, it's going to ask me for that Gmail address and password so I can actually complete the setup, okay? So there you go. Any questions or issues, just comment below, all right? Good luck, guys.